What is up everyone? Welcome back to Whales and Locks and uh, in today's video we're going to be looking at Duke at Miami. Uh, Duke is minus nine and a half in this ball game and the over under is set at 139. Um, so this is a matchup right now of two teams that appear to be trending in opposite directions. On the Duke side they're trending in a very good direction and look like a tournament team now finally after after looking like they may not make the tournament two weeks ago. We still have a lot of season left but they definitely look much better. They're currently sitting at um, seven and five on the season, five and three in the ACC, with two quality wins in their last two games. Uh, they're led by their phenomenal sophomore uh, big guy in Matthew Hurt, who is absolutely dominating right now, averaging 19 points a game and shooting 44 percent from three. Uh, he's just been an absolute monster this season. Um, on the Miami side, this is an absolute mess right now. Uh, they're currently sitting at six and ten, uh, two and nine in the ACC, and they've lost their last four games. Um, by an average of 18 and a half points. They currently um, are sitting with only six scholarship players available in their previous game. This is what they had, and one of them is a walk-on. Uh, head coach Jim Laranega has mentioned uh, that in order to win some of these games, they really have to slow the pace down um, because they just don't have the talent right now, and, and that's very true. Uh, so therefore, um, the play does seem uh, to be Duke minus nine and a half, but I want to slow your roll there. Duke this season is three and nine against the spread. And I don't want to be falling for that trap here. I think the play, therefore, is under 139, as Miami um, has not eclipsed 60 points in any of their last four games, and I don't think it will happen here. Um, even if they did eclipse 60 points, my, Duke would have to score almost 80, and I don't think that will be happening in this game. So there you have it in the 7 p.m. Eastern Time game. I do think under 139 is the play, as Miami looks to uh, turn this game into a definite slugfest.